It's probably hard to imagine, but among Iranian women it's quite popular ninjutsu hobby. These Iranian women devote most of their time to learning the art of war, and aspire to become real ninja warriors. They are excellent with weapons, perform dizzying tricks, and generally do everything to become perfect soldiers. Called such women kunoichi, they wear clothes of Japanese ninja, learn the skills of hand-to-hand -hand combat, and learn to master the various types of knives. Apparently the popularity of ninjutsu among Iranian women can be explained by the specificity of their clothes, which are very similar to the clothes of Japanese ninja, that allowed adapting this martial art to the local mentality and forming women's ninja combat units in the country. Ninja clubs exist all over Iran. They consist of about four, zero female ninja who not only wield many kinds of weapons and have skills in hand-to-hand -hand combat, but are also able to move silently and infiltrate the enemy's rear, such as secret weapon of Iran, the women say this training helps them stay physically fit as well as spiritually fit. The training is always difficult and intense, conducted without regard to gender, and in sparring, they never feel sorry for each other. In addition to their close combat skills, Kunoichi must also be able to employ their feminine charms. Female ninja are taught the basic principles of martial arts, concentration, strength, and balance. The ability to hold a balance at any point is a very important skill in the art of ninja and for this they often require the highest acrobatic training, which is given special attention. The schools of ninjutsu master a variety of weapons, including very exotic ones. All these female warriors are proficient in swords, nunchakus and shuriken. They are even taught how to use various poisons. Often training takes place outdoors, often in the middle of the desert, where the temperature sometimes rises to 70 degrees. In the desert, the women go through a harsh school of survival. Here the training usually takes place in small groups of about 10 people. They learn the science of survival, perform complicated tricks with weapons in their hands to learn how to use them on the move, learn to climb and jump from high, smooth walls, and learn how to slit an enemy's throat with a single swing without making a sound. The system in Kunoichi schools ensures that female graduates make incredible progress in this martial art, and they graduate as true professional warriors. It is even said that female ninja who have reached a certain level of success serve in the foreign intelligence service, but that is not accurate. The female students of these schools themselves say that in the classes they learn discipline and the ability to appreciate themselves. Here we are free. Ninjutsu philosophy has become our philosophy of life. We learn to endure everyday hardships, to be patient, strong, and disciplined.